morning all I'm just sitting here eating my pop tart got a okay night's sleep uh, definitely better than the last couple nights but my head is still fucking pounding I've, I don't think I've ever had a migraine last multiple days but it's not the best eating pills to try to calm it down I feel okay at the moment but um, last night I woke up in the middle of the night and it was fucking killing me again so hopefully get that resolved pretty soon. It is before six o'clock, starting to get wrapped up. It looks like everyone else is packing up as well. And we'll be moving pretty shortly here today. The goal is to get to South Lake Tahoe. It's 20, 21 miles from here or something like that. Um, Ghost Rider has some folks here that are able to possibly give us a ride you know to the place so if we get out late tonight we should be okay still shouldn't be an issue and I think we're on a plan to go to the house hopefully get a pizza or two and uh, have a chill night Had a bunch of these little snow traverses. I haven't put on spikes, it's like kind of slushy, but I've slipped twice now in the worst places where I would have been gone if I didn't catch myself. I'm so sick of fucking snow. So we got a sweet double trail magic going on. We got the uh, the breakfast burritos and the drinks and fruit from uh, Ghost Rider's dad. And then over here at the visitor center, we got some other snacks and they had fruit and drinks as well. I think they always have stuff out for PCT hikers. So this parking area is the place to be this morning. Boy, I'm having a good day. <clears throat> we left the parking lot of the Trail Magic from Ghost Riders family, and uh, we got to a different parking lot. And there was a gentleman named Sam, and I believe his wife, who recognized Chap and I from the channels. And I want to say thank you for saying hi and for following along. It was nice to meet you. Been hiking through this kind of stuff. Very beautiful nice easy hiking and uh there's a hiker who passed right by me um who did the pct last year his name is all in and he said hey i got some trail magic in my pack for you if you'd be interested and he gave me a handful of pringles he gave me a beer he gave me a couple oranges so i'm just i'm just chilling for a little bit this is awesome this is a very very good day so far. I'm seeing a big old body of water right here in the distance. I assume that that's Lake Tahoe. I could be totally wrong, but it's very large and it seems like the right distance for where we're headed. It 
stopped and had a quick lunch. It wasn't really that much of a lunch. I ate a bunch of snacks. I was still kind of full for all this fucking trail magic. Um, we just went up and over the last real climb of the day, and now we have a whole lot of down for a bit. There's a little bump that goes up right at the end uh, of the day, but nothing significant. We're going to try to make it to Echo Lake, which is a couple more miles, but then we can actually close out the Sierra far out map. And uh, then coming out of South Lake, we'll be starting fresh with the Northern California map. the parking lot for Echo Lake that means we are done with the Sierra map and that means we have tonight and two zeros ahead of us and I'm so excited I'm excited to get off this foot I've limped the last two miles or so we're here in South Lake Tahoe this is the place we are going to be staying at it looks super nice excited to check it out been to many houses where they got a hot tub on the roof. This is dope. All right, here's the upstairs of this house. I haven't filmed shit today. I guess I felt I needed a little break. We had a very large pizza, wings, salad kind of dinner. It was all very good. We drank wine um, and then we sat and watched hammer hikes on YouTube, surprisingly. I had to sit and watch my awful self talking to a fucking camera. <laughs> I don't love you, it that You spit your drink out and you thought you were so funny. I am fucking funny. If you don't think I'm funny, then why the fuck are you watching, honestly? <laughs> but um, I've got literally nothing else tonight. I'm going to go probably sit in this fucking rooftop hot tub, but I'm sure it's dark up there. I probably can't show you anything. So yeah, I'm just going to close out for the night. I'll show you the rest of the house and this whole this whole setup tomorrow and uh, we'll see what we can get into in this wonderful town of South Lake Tahoe. I'm going to shout out Grimy tonight. I haven't seen you since Baden Powell, I think, uh, but I saw your name in a registry today. I think you're only like a day ahead of us or something like that. So uh, shout out Grimy. Hope to see you soon. And take care, everyone. I will see y'all in the morning. <laughs> Peace out. Good morning, everyone. Here is the view from my bedroom. Yes, I actually slept on the roof last night. Right next to the hot tub. I jumped in the hot tub as soon as I woke up. It was fucking incredible. Probably the best night of sleep I've had in quite a while now. We got breakfast going downstairs. And... I'm not sure what all we're going to get into today. We have a lot of ideas, a lot of fun things we've been talking about, but I don't know how many of them will actually actually come to fruition. We all have to, you know, do the resupply thing and I have to get new shoes somewhere. I think we need to do a post office run, all that kind of stuff. Uh, hopefully we can get all that shit done today and then tomorrow could be like a nice chill fun day. Uh, but we will see how everything shakes out. It's a beautiful day. And I'm excited to see a little more of Lake Tahoe. This is the downstairs of the place that we're staying. We got the air hockey table. Bedrooms. Out there is their boat, which we are welcome to use if we would like. Thank 
traffic. All right, we're getting ready to leave the house to go do all of our running around and I've collected all the shit that I'm shipping home. So the ice axe is going along with the micro spikes. We're hoping that we don't, I mean, we haven't really needed them. We did a couple of traverses yesterday where I probably should have used them, but I didn't. Uh, we're just gonna hope for the best, get rid of that shit. Uh, I'm sending the gators home. I haven't been wearing them. I haven't really felt like I needed them. It's just an extra thing, so they're gonna go. These are the rain pants that I got from groceries. I'm gonna send those home too. I'm keeping the Enlightened Equipment wind pants. Um, these are just a little heavier. I already have a rain kilt, so I don't need those for rain. It doesn't fucking rain out here anyway. I'm gonna send home my smart wool leggings and keep the uh, cosmic leggings. The cosmic ones are a little lighter and they're more fun, so I'm gonna ship these home. And then this is a bunch of random shit. I had the half mile notes printed out up to Tuolumne. I haven't even looked at them, so I'm not even gonna worry about shipping out the next set. And just like some adapters from the platypus filter and things like that. So good little pile of things going home. It's gonna feel really nice. And it's a decent amount of weight too. I mean, the ax itself is a pound. Spikes I think are a little over a pound. So, uh, you know, over two pounds going home and off the back. So that's great. All right, this morning's been a little bit of a vortex. We hit a couple different outfitters. We hit the grocery store, um, the post office. I got all that shit sent home. This is the resupply haul for today. I didn't have to get a whole lot because I had so much food left over. And we're only doing three days to Truckee. So I just had to get a bunch of snacks, um, wraps, cookies for breakfast, and then some little odds and ends, sunscreen, toothpaste, band-aids I really need as my feet are all <clears throat> tore apart. And speaking of that, I did get in Gingy's back. Um, these are just going to help with the blisters I've been having. I tried to not use these, but these just always work really well for my feet, so I'm going to go back to them. And I actually am going to try a different shoe. <clears throat> so these are the Topo Traverse. I upsized, so these are 13s. I, I typically wear 12s. And these are supposed to have more aggressive tread, and they're supposed to be more of a stable shoe. So that should help, you know, prevent my foot from turning in as they have been. So I hope they work out well. Um, <clears throat> the reason I didn't try these from the get go is because the stack height is a little smaller than the Ultra Ventures. But yeah. Got pretty much all of the stupid chores done. Not sure what, what we're going to get into for the rest of the day, but I will be sure to take you along. Alright, we are back at the house. We had a good time at the brewery. It was like a pour your own kind of deal. First time I ever did something like that, but it was neat. Something different. Uh, the music was good. It was fun. So we picked up a bunch of Thai food. We're about to chow down, and I'm not sure what the rest of the night is going to entail. We've talked about doing karaoke. We've also talked about just hanging out here, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> but we got about six miles to do that. Yeah, we're elevation again. Alright, y'all, I'm gonna apologize because I forgot to do a closeout video last night. Not because I partied too hard. Not like last time. I just really forgot. I guess I owe a shout out anyway, so I'll give a shout out to Mixtape. I saw him in the grocery store and he made me laugh. So shout out Mixtape. It is the next morning. Just waking up. It's like eight o'clock. Um last night we ate our Thai food and watched some of DJ's YouTube videos. Then uh bunch of us came up here onto the roof, got in the hot tub again, and we just chilled in there for probably too long. And I slept up here again. DJ and 24 are leaving this morning after breakfast. They are gonna get a head start and hopefully we'll be able to catch them, you know, within a couple days or something like that. And we'll, I'm sure we'll be leapfrogging with them throughout 
the hike, but uh, their pace is a little different than ours. So uh, they're kind of doing more of their own thing from here on out, it, it sounds like. But uh, yeah, I'm sure we'll be seeing them a bunch more either way. Breakfast is going downstairs. Some people are still sleeping, but it seems like everyone's starting to move. Today should be a fun day. Um, Cece and I are going to go get tattooed. Uh, spur of the moment kind of thing. Um, I'm getting something really fucking stupid. <laughs> that kind of ties into this hike a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to share it or not. Because uh, I don't really want to explain the story. But maybe. We'll see. So tattoos are just afternoon. The others I think are going out on the boat. Um, I have a feeling between the tattoo appointment and Chap and I's live chat today, we're probably gonna have to miss out on the boat ride. Most of our chores are done. We've got a full day off yet again. So I'm sure we can relax and have some fun today. A brewery over there. Tattoo time, tattoo time, tattoo time, tattoo time. Tattoo's done. I'll show y'all later. It's all covered in blood and shit right now. It doesn't look great, but uh, we are now walking through Harris and. I, I mean, Chap's excited. I just want to eat. <laughs> All right, a lot's happened in the last couple hours. Um, first off, here's the tattoo. Uh, got it all cleaned off, covered back up. There's the Coors Light tattoo. Shout out Long Nose Pete, yet again. Other than that, we came back, well, we stopped at the, at the uh, casino for a minute. Uh, we were going to get food there, but that didn't happen. And then we sort of had to rush back to the house to do our live chat. Chap and I did the live on YouTube. That went well. Thank you all for watching. And we hope to do it again soon. The others got back from their time on the boat. And we've just been kind of hanging out and talking about things. I think we're going to zero again and do a triple zero for the first time. I think it would be nice to take another day off the feet. The others aren't really rushing to get out of this awesome house that we're staying in. And, um, you know, what better place than South Lake Tahoe for a triple. So that's the plan right now. We're going to go get some food. Um, I think we're going to cook some shit from the grocery store or something like that and just have a chill night inside. All right, we're back from the grocery store and we got some tacos going. Taco night, taco night. After taco night, we just sat, we watched a movie, we watched some YouTube comedy kind of shit, and that's pretty much all that we did. Nothing too exciting. We just acted like normal fucking people for once. Tomorrow, we have another zero, um, and it's probably going to be more boring bullshit. I have to still find the hole in my sleeping pad. I have to do some editing and just get some things together. Uh, we'll see what tomorrow brings. I will see you all in the morning. Shout out to Misha. Good night, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Well, not really morning. It's kind of late morning. Um, had a lovely breakfast yet again. And here we are on zero number three. Today, I think the plan is to go out on the boat. The other folks want to go out again, and I haven't been out yet, so it sounds like a good time. This is the boat right out here. Um, I think we're going to plan to leave in the next 45 minutes to an hour. I drowned my fucking sleeping pad in the bathtub this morning. I did find the leak, so that's drying outside. I just have to throw some tenacious tape on there and hopefully be good to go. I also am getting hooked the fuck up uh, with a good deal on a Z-Pax duplex. So I got that two-person tent coming. 
Uh, thank you, Nate, for hooking me up. Other than that, don't have anything else planned. Got to get caught up on videos today. And all the other chores are done. So it's been a good stay. I'm happy that uh, I get another day off my feet. My feet are feeling much better. Oh, shit. No way. <laughs> Bro, that's a cheater. The whole top split like yeah. perfectly if it didn't fall. Wow. Wow, I was right. Good work. I'm gonna feel like I'm about to Good work, TC Grace. <laughs> Cooler over here. Through stuff. I mean, I had to spend I mean, at least 25 minutes putting on sunscreen. I had to like throw my leg up over the boat to get in. We're through hiking. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is rough. This is rough. Yeah. Had a sweet little ride out to Emerald Bay, and now we just uh, stopped at this pier here, and we're gonna walk out and see what's going on here. I don't know if they got food and drinks or whatever, but a lot of people here. Cheers, puppy! Had a good day out on the boat. My back is fucking fried. Hope that doesn't affect my hiking, but now we are here playing Jenga! <laughs> Alright, fuckers, I'm tapping out. I gotta fucking catch up on editing. I uh, played a bunch of Jenga, fell asleep. Now I woke up and I woke up like semi hungover at like nine o'clock and we have to hike tomorrow and I don't want to hike tomorrow We're hiking tomorrow. or ever again. <laughs> so we got fucking Taco Bell door dash into us and uh, other than that, I'm never drinking alcohol again. Promise? Yeah. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna drink, a, drink a bunch of water, start getting cleaned up and uh, that's about it for me. This triple zero was amazing, had a good time, and uh, I'm excited about it, but we gotta get focused and get back to hiking tomorrow. So I'm gonna start editing, getting caught up, and I'll talk to y'all in the morning. I'm gonna give a shout out to Hound Dog tonight. See y'all in the morning. Peace out.